Hi, I'm Steve Lloyd. And I'm Wes Lloyd. Welcome to our channel. This is the Lloyd Boys. This is our very first episode. And today we're visiting the Velo Solutions Pump Track at Daybreak. This is our third time here and it is an amazing facility. It's brand new, um, it's all asphalt, and it's extremely fast. Yeah, it's super fast, it's all asphalt, so you don't ever have to worry about like washing out with super sandy stuff. And I've rode tons of pump tracks for the past years. This by far is already my favorite, just from the past three days. If you've heard of Velo Solution pump tracks, you know that they are built really, really well. This track probably costs around $350,000 to $400,000 and is the first of its kind in Utah. Needless to say, we are stoked to have it here. Velo Solutions pump track. Shredding with Westies. Buzzing on the asphalt. Did get you going? So tiring. Pretty good cardio workout, huh? Seriously, it really takes your breath away. So these ones are a little more, like you really have to pull your arms up and then push them down. Yeah. Like, it's super hard. Like the two rollers there, these first three rollers are super big. So you really have to like tuck up to float over them. It's crazy. Us and I are both getting our workout at the park here. It's, uh, it's a lot more exercise than you think. Alright, this pump truck's right in the middle of a brand new neighborhood that's just being built as we speak, so the audio a little bit choppy right now because there's loud tractors and dump trucks, but it's gonna be cool. These bowls are super tall, it's almost like riding a skate park snake run. They're super steep so you can hang into them really hard. And they're also steep enough where they work as great fly outs. So there, we're, what do we think, about seven foot tall berms? Yeah, taller than me. Yeah, so they're about seven feet. They're, they're huge dishes for sure, it's, it's amazing. And you stick to the walls when you like fly through there. This is Ghost Rider, permission to buzz the tower. Negative Ghost Rider, the pattern is full. Sorry Goose, but it's time to buzz the tower. There are some really cool transfers, gaps, and doubles. Some of them were pretty big and have high consequences. It took a little bit of warming up, but Weston worked his way up to some of the bigger gaps. Which as a parent makes me a little nervous, but Weston's gained my trust over the years and I know that he rides smart. And to be honest, it is pretty cool to watch him hit some of these bigger gaps. Okay, Wyatt wasn't with us this morning, but here he is. Track. Why is it awesome? Well, because it's like not like the other pump track where it's like as all the bumps, it's like as a rhythm that you go to and you have the feel and like you can do some really sick transfers like there's this gap right here you can go over a berm and I just like it. Well, when you pick up speed, like you start to like um like fuck yourself on the rollers like this pump track is located in an extremely dense neighborhood with lots of families and young kids. If you want to go fast and have the track to yourself, showing up early or on off hours when kids are in school is probably ideal. If not, uh, just plan on dealing with the little groms. It's awesome to see these little kids getting out and having fun. And this pump truck really works your lungs, so I'm so freaking out of breath. You said the wind got you on the last one? Yeah. I keep trying to do this transfer, but the wind keeps blowing me. It's spooky. Mm.
it can become quite dangerous when a lot of kids show up going all kinds of directions on the track. So once it got busy, we decided to pack it up and head out. This pump track was pretty rad to visit and we're stoked that you came with us today. Please subscribe and check out our other videos that are soon to come.